Oh, hello, your highness. Hello, sir. Uh, what, what could I do for you? I have a mathematical issue. Well, what is it? Well, I know that I have five blueberries. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, no, that sounds reasonable. And I, yeah, I, I verify that or I can see that you definitely have five blueberries here. Well, well what's the problem? Well, I also knew that I have three cherries. One, two, three. Okay, well, that seems pretty straightforward. Yep, you have three cherries. But I need to figure out how many total pieces of fruit I have. And I do not know, do I take five and add three? Or do I take five and subtract three? I knew it's something to do with five and three, but I don't know what to do. You have to help me right now. Stop it. Help me right now. Really, really fast. Okay. Okay, queen. Uh, well, calm down. I, I think our friends here can, can actually help us out a little bit. So why don't we let them pause this video and try to think about it on their own. So we know we have five blueberries and we have three cherries. So the question is, if we want to calculate how many total pieces of fruit do we have, do we take five blueberries and add three cherries to it? Or do we take our five blueberries, do we take our five blueberries and then subtract, subtract three from it? So I'll let our friends pause this video and think about, think about which one actually is describing this situation that the queen is in. Okay, they can pause, but they need to really hurry because I'm really in a hurry and I really need to know how many pieces of fruit I actually have. Okay, okay. So I'm, I'm assuming they, they've, they've had a go at it. So let's think about it. When you add something, you're going to increase the amount of fruit. And when you start with five blueberries, we're increasing it by three. If you are subtracting three, that means that you are taking away blueberries, or you're taking away pieces of fruit. So the situation you've described is five plus five plus three. If you did five minus three, that would be starting with your blueberries. So that would be starting with your blueberries. So let me, whoops, let me make sure I can copy and paste or redraw the blueberries here. So Copy and paste. So five minus three would have been starting with the five blueberries and then taking away three. So you take away one, two, three. Ooh, I think I get it. When I add, I increase the number of fruit. If I'm increasing the number of fruit, I add. If I'm taking away, then that's subtraction. Subtraction is taking away. So I know to add, so how many pieces of fruit do I have? Well, five plus three, we can see is, this is five, and then we have six, seven, eight pieces of fruit. So that's going to be eight in total. That's fascinating. Now that you've taught me a little bit about subtraction, I'm also curious, what would five minus three be? Well, we see it right over here. We start with five and you take away one, two, three. You're left with these blueberries right over here. You're left with one, two blueberries. So five minus three is two. Ooh, that's just wonderful. I'm, I'm happy I could help you.